What's going on, everybody? I um, I just want to jump on here real quick and um, just kind of talk about uh, <clears throat> excuse me some of the things that I'm seeing. You know, uh, Kevin Samuels did a uh, did a little video with a, a young lady on there, and um, she was um, not very attractive. Let me just say that, and. You know, I'm finding a lot of people on Facebook and various other platforms are coming down on Kevin because they feel like he shouldn't have said what he said to her. It was insensitive. It was um, not, you know, not very, uh, how can I say? It wasn't soft enough, I guess, uh, his delivery about uh, the the whole dynamic of what she was asking for. And I think he told her just fine. Let me just say that. I, I feel like he told her just fine. She, um, she felt like she was entitled to have a man who had money. Um, she really didn't offer up anything in return uh, for being in a relationship or being married to a man uh, of means, as Kevin says. You know, uh, I just don't understand why it's so hard for, for the ladies to understand that um, what he's offering is the truth. He's not trying to sugarcoat it for her because he's trying to do her a service. This is something that I, I just don't, um, I don't understand why they, they don't get that. Um, and, and more and more, you know, I'm looking at these responses and it's like, you know, how dare he tell, you know, tell her that she can't have what she wants. Well, shit, I want to be an astronaut. You know, but that just wasn't possible. You know, circumstances did not allow for me to be, you know, a friggin' astronaut. So, uh, in this this world that we live in now, it's it's almost um, just crazy for you to tell a person the truth. And if you do tell them the truth, then somehow you're you're being mean. You're you're you know you're you're not, uh, you know, allowing them to, I guess, dream and motivate themselves enough to go and get what they want, you know, but I mean, I guess what it's coming down to is it just, uh, the ladies just tend to, to live in a fairy tale existence. You know, a lot of them, not, I'm not going to say all, but, um, you know, some of them live in a fairy tale existence and um, they just cannot fathom the fact that everybody can have what they want. You know, they, they feel that everybody should get a trophy. And that's that's I, I, I blame society for that. You know, you get the, the, you get a D, you get a trophy. You know, you get a C, you get a trophy. Used to be you just get trophies when you had A's and B's. Now you, you get a trophy for anything. You get a trophy for just showing up. You know, you can be as, you know, inept as you want to be and you still get a trophy. You know, I, 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 I'm very disappointed um, in us uh, because it used to be, you know, we were coming up. You know, people uh, ascribe to be educated and to to be better than what they were. That that no longer seems to be the case. Uh, it seems like uh, now, you know, all you have to do is just, you know, just want to be the best. You know, you can just dream to be the best. You don't have to put any, put forth any effort. You don't have to do anything. All you have to do is just. wish it just uh you know take me as i am do the disney thing 
you know, continue to just watch the princess just go through hell. And then eventually she gets everything that she wants with no effort whatsoever. You know, and if y'all want to, you know, subscribe to that, you know, then you deserve what you get. It's really a shame. It really is a shame that that we don't embrace uh, intelligent uh, discourse, um, logical thinking. We, we don't we don't subscribe to any of that anymore. It's just a bunch of a bunch of reality TV and Jan LeVan Zantz. Love and hip hop, you know, all of that garbage. Everybody subscribed to all of that bullshit, and now that's what we're stuck with. Uh, you know, that's my take. You know, uh, if you like uh, the beginnings of what what I'm starting here, you know, please like, share, and subscribe, and uh, I'll be back. Appreciate you.